It took 12 innings in two days, but Zeeland West beat Reese Puffer 4-3 in the Division I Baseball Regional. The Ducks completed the comeback thanks to an infield ground ball off the bat of Cam Schussler with the bases loaded to score Corey Holtrust. Our dugout is so positive. Even the guys that aren't on the field, they're just riling us all up. And the starters here, were, you saw we were so exhausted but we just kept fighting. And there's not one kid on this field tonight that wanted to go home. And so it makes sense to me that it took so long. And I mean, you got to be impressed by the way that Reese Puffer kept fighting. Uh, but man, I'm so proud of our boys and the way that uh, when they didn't get it done, they continued to fight. The Rockets led the game three to one when it resumed in the top of the third inning. Zealand West senior Tarek DeYoung began the day on the mound and threw eight and a third scoreless innings, allowing just one hit and two total base runners because coach was talking before um, we were we started off really slow in the beginning past day and he told me to uh, to come in and throw a lot of strikes and that's what I did and a lot of balls got put in play but our defense was there Carter Hughes was the winning pitcher after tossing a scoreless top of the 12th word began to spread around the field at Reese Puffer among Ducks players and fans that the Rockets had already chartered a bus to Mount Pleasant on Saturday for the Super Regional for the game we got here pretty early and my coach Locker told us that they scheduled a charter bus and that honestly just riled us up even more. Like you could see and feel the energy through us. It was just, it was crazy, an unbelievable atmosphere. I will use every tactic possible uh, to inspire our kids. And um, I'm not exactly sure um, if that was true or not. Sometimes all it takes is a little motivation no matter how or where that motivation comes from. The Ducks are on to the regional in Mount Pleasant on Saturday to take on Midland Dow. In Muskegon, Jason Hutton, Fox 17 News.